I started to drink a little bit in my at the age of 42. Very nice. Yeah. Because you were not no. an alcohol. Coffee drinker. and alcohol. I love this. This is yeah. a new bold new chapter. Yeah. We're going to have like some fun. Like let, let loose a little bit, you <laughs> Good. know? Kim Kardashian opens up about why she decided to start drinking alcohol in her 40s. The biggest misconception of me is that I'm a wild, crazy party girl. I mean, I don't even drink alcohol, so I can't stay up too late and party. Yeah, Kim's made it pretty clear in the past. She was never a fan of boozy beverages. But now that she's made a change, the Mama 4 dished Why on the Goop podcast with Gwyneth Paltrow. Why are you allowing yourself to let loose now? Because why not? You know, I just feel like I work a lot and I focus really like all day after school, then it's like product meetings and testing things and packaging meetings and everything for skin. Kim says between mom life, work life and studying for the bar, she barely has any time to let her hair down. But when she allows herself to take a breather, a drink helps. I just don't ever feel comfortable just like laying around doing nothing. So right. my version of that has been to spend some time with my friends and have a drink Great. and stay out a little bit later when I probably wouldn't have done that before. Even if I'm a little bit tired the next day in my workout, just that time. It's really lit and, and fun and crazy. Kim makes it clear she's not drinking on the daily and she isn't one for wine. But when she does indulge, she goes for... Just tequila. Tequila. Yeah. Just has to be like a, sh a little a shot little. of pineapple and a shot of tequila. Perfect. Yeah. That's so good. I'm like glad you're Two doing shots that. and I'm like, <laughs> so good. It's been fun. There's different sides of me. So while this is the first time we're hearing Kim explain her newfound appreciation for liquor, we've seen little glimpses here and there on social media. Like back in August during her sis Kylie Jenner's birthday celebration. Kim totally went for it, even if it didn't go down smoothly. Happy birthday! Wait, what? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, guessing at the time she was still getting used to the taste. Wait, what? <laughs> <laughs> So while Kim's having fun in cocktails with her friends, she also reveals to Gwyneth that she's still open to the idea of getting hitched again. Why not? I have this like fantasy in my head, like fourth time's a charm. It's exactly. gonna, it's gonna work out. Now I feel like I will definitely take my time and I would be okay for like a forever partnership as yeah. well. I think I would definitely want, I would want a marriage, but I'm so happy to take my time. A somewhat surprising revelation that comes just a month after Kim finalized her divorce from her third husband, Kanye West. I definitely protected him mm -hmm. and I still will mm -hmm. in the eyes of my kids, for my kids. Prior to Ye, the Skims founder was married to Damon Thomas and Chris Humphreys. For now, the beauty mogul says she wants to be single for a few years. So Kim, we support you and say, Cheers. Yeah, I'm I glad you two doing shots that. and I'm like <laughs> so good. It's been fun.